Start recording. I have to wait three seconds. So, uh, welcome back to Game of the Goons and another episode of Rambling On. Um, the name coming from Dan, who was with us last time, unfortunately can't make it today, so it's just got the original four. What's up, guys? What's up? Hello. Um, and today we are taking on the topic that Grant gave us last week, so which was, I believe it was Gaming Fails. Um, I believe so. Or dis- yeah. Yeah, yeah all dis- dis- disappointments and fails. Yeah, yeah. So it can be like wh- whether it's like your disappointed games or whether, um, or, or just general fails in gaming. Um, but before yeah. that, um, but uh, yeah, can we see how everyone's doing a lockdown. Um, well, I'm doing. I, I'm well. There's nothing else to do, is there? Like, like I I posted on my Facebook the other day. Bought Resident Evil Three. And managed to complete the game on platinum in two days. So yeah, that's it's my life game. now. It's pretty good going. <laughs> so I've only done like half an hour. <laughs> it's a half an hour that went to air. Yeah, the half an hour. The 30, <laughs> but it's a good thirty minutes though. I was like, what's it, yeah, it, yeah, it was a bit longer. Yeah, yeah, it was good. But you, the, the magic of editing, you didn't see one bit of that. You saw a lot of rice <laughs> milk. <laughs> I mean, except for that, um, I, there's something else that I do want to say, and that is that um, if uh, everyone please do, I know the lockdown is a little bit too much at the moment, but please stay indoors. I mean, if you have listened to the news, Boris Johnson has, um, hopefully he gets better soon, but and please do stay at home, it, you, otherwise you're going to just make it worse for the whole of England and but everything's just going to get... The, the longer... It's going to keep pushing it back. Yeah, the longer people don't follow it, the longer the longer the lockdown will occur because you're trying to limit numbers. Um yeah. and so either you'll either have stricter rules or or you'll have a longer lockdown to to ensure that the we prevent um hospitals getting overwhelmed. Yeah, so that's so why it's please, important to follow. Yeah, just stay at home if you can. So how's Grant and Wong doing in lockdown? I mean, mine sounds not very interesting because cause I'm virtually working as normal from home and it has been quite busy for us because I'm, well, in fact, going to details, <laughs> client confidentiality and all that, oh, yeah, but it's, yeah, it's um, a lot of queries and lots of people with concerns about the, the situation. So we're, we're just doing our best to help them in, in the way we can. And yeah, it's the VAT deadline. Doesn't mean much to some people, but <laughs> it's a busy day. <laughs> <laughs> busy, busy work. As always. But no, in some ways, I'm grateful for the work because it, it keeps my routine fairly normal. Um, yeah, yeah. No, and it's, it stop, yeah, stops the boredom creeping in, in that sense because I do have a purpose to get up every day. Yeah, exactly. Because it's like I'm here on my own. It's just like now I'm not. I, I was sort of working on and off, and now I'm I'm not really working um, unless I get like called back in. So I'm just like, oh, what do I do all this time? Mm. <laughs> Lee just on PlayStation all the time. Pretty much. Yeah, Lee's yeah. always on PlayStation. Night. Finishing playing Hearts. Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> no, 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 I did edit a video. A couple of days. <laughs> How are you doing, one? Uh, super busy. The most busy than actually before lockdown. Because because <laughs> now it's just like <clears throat> at at home and then like you kind of lost in track track of time. So it's like sometimes working until like seven or eight, and I don't realize that until like dinner and then like. Ah, uh, yeah. So uh, yeah, for me, it's just kind of super busy, really. Ah, yeah, I can imagine. But no, it's good though to be a. a, a I mean, it's better to be busy than. Than doing nothing. <laughs> Sat around. Like you. Yeah, I know. Playing video, yeah, <laughs> doing nothing, video playing video games. That's <laughs> no, I, I, I can't. That's, so. that's the worst. Walk. That's the worst, right? <laughs> I get board games and I'll film them. <laughs> yeah, but funny you say, because I can understand the same situations. But working from home, I'm like, oh, well, I normally get home at half six anyway, so I find myself working up to half six, like longer than I normally would. Not so I don't, I don't work hard anyway, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's um, quick. quick. You just lose track of time, <laughs> as you say. Time goes really quickly. Yeah, yeah. 
it's, it's, it's weird to get a time and a lot of people are really tired now as well so like I, I've gone for a stage not so much now but I was last week I was just like exhausted and I'm like, but I've done nothing I mean it's just such a change in situation that you're always so stressed <laughs> yeah that is true right back onto our um, actual topic so game and fails or failed games so anyone got anything in mind or um oh it's quite hard to say to be honest yeah. like all the games i've really played i think the only thing is the rant that i went on about dead island oh, too. Good <laughs> you have that, to bring that, it back with that, yeah I, I can't help of it though you know me like i waited so long for the game and it still hasn't come out <laughs> do you know what, do you know what game i waited for a long long time and and the first game, I don't know if it's classic game and fail, but it it didn't, it wasn't a commercial success. But the game is wholly underrated, and that's Beyond Good and Evil, on PS2, I believe. Okay. okay. It's, it, it sounds weird. It's going to sound really weird, but basically, it's like a it's like a third person adventure game. There's the the boss fights. There's a little bit of like action, um, but it's not too much. It's more like a, a puzzle action game. Um, and I, all the creatures are like different like animals like pigs or, or <laughs> different like a, like humanoid animals but the storyline was so good um, and they go to and they go to re- remaster one they've remastered on the on the PS3 I think no PS3 or PS4 oh, sorry I meant I think it's like PS4 in... possibly PS4 I think... I've, seen, I've seen it on PS4 I think I think sorry, I meant I meant the the good do a second one. Isn't oh it? yeah, yeah. They do, but they announced a sequel. I don't know if it'll happen because they announced a sequel on twenty seventeen. I've played. Did I play it in? I played it, and I don't know whether I played it in. Where did I play that? It could have been the um, yeah, the games three? expo. No, no, the Beyond Good and Evil two. Oh. I could have played it at the games expo. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure. Or it was like a beta trial <laughs> demo. But the thing is, they haven't come out with anything yet. No, yeah. So... Or was it gameplay footage? Mm. It could have been gameplay footage. But it's it's really good, mm. and but it's it's been delayed for about four years now. 2017. Yeah, I know. <sighs> I mean, I mean, that's not much of a delay compared to uh, Dead Island. <laughs> <you're saying. laughs> well, well, if, if you have to put it like this compared to Kingdom Hearts. Well, yeah. Kingdom Actually, Hearts. No, Kingdom Heart Three was only delayed for ten years, but there were other games. <laughs> only, only delayed for ten years. No, which is actually, no. Actually, no. They didn't delay it. Actually, it never got announced that it was going to come out until yeah. like two or three years ago. There were other games like Birth by Sleep, um, uh, like uh, yeah, Dream Drop Distance. Ones. Uh, yeah, Dream Drop Distance. Uh, three hundred and fifty-eight over two or three hundred fifty-six. Over two days, I forgot which one it was. Around fifty eight. I think it's yeah, over two days, and um, you know all the other ones that are getting involved. From what was also being released as well, which I'm so happy, Kingdom Heart Four will be released, uh, which is uh, in the which next is 10 years. no in the next few. It actually will be next years, but they're going to get one more game involved before Kingdom Hearts Four. Uh, what what which is on three point five. <laughs> On a completely different 20, console. 2030 is when, we're, when the next next Kingdom Hearts comes out. <laughs> well, the, the main come to those who wait. <laughs> <laughs> well, talk about they, oh, sorry, they probably run out of source source material. A lot of Disney oh, Disney wise. No, they do not. They do not because it's the same story. Um, the, the Disney characters are more like just a um like an add on kind of thing. They're not oh, apart from like. Doesn't... Yeah, it's got it's got a lot of um, backgrounds and everything of the Disney thing, but the main story doesn't really talk mainly about Disney. It talks about it. Uh, it talks about it's the same story. Dark, and, like, it, it, it talks light about darkness. a light and darkness. Yeah, what it's about. and and like the Disney characters are intertwined, but they wouldn't really run out of source material for it if it makes sense. Yeah, but not for a it, while anyway. Actually, I think Grant, you might ha- you might have a game where we were actually going to post it up, but then Grant oh, had yeah. a go at it, and he 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 said it wasn't worth doing a series on because um, it was quite a 
it was the remake was kind of weird. And mm-hmm. I believe it was um, Medieval, was it, Grant? Yeah, really oh, cool. yeah. It's not even on my list, that one. But, yeah, I, I should forget about that. Because, um, I mean, I hadn't, I hadn't played the original when it came out on PS1 I haven't. 20 years ago. Nah. Okay. Um, it's the game looks fun enough. No, it's, it's, not, it's, kind of, it's kind of like a... It's horror... Style, but it's quite cartoony, I guess. Yeah. But oh. The gameplay plays like it played twenty years ago. Like the controls are awful. Oh, really? So it's poor in it. It won't come back. Yeah. It, it's almost like a literal remake with new graphics. Yeah. So they ported it and upgraded the graphics, but forgot to interwine the controls. <laughs> I'd say so. Or, I mean, some remasters are you know, really literal. good. Yeah. Yeah. But I think they've been a bit too faithful, I guess, to, to the original. I mean, it's, it's not a bad game. Don't get me wrong. But I mean, I just found it a bit underwhelming. Yeah, yeah but and the gameplay just wasn't very interesting. We we read about stuff and all of that, and uh, we thought we could do a quick video, like maybe a series on it. But after Grant said um, how the gameplay was and everything like that, we just thought it was it's not even worth. Unfortunately, I'm sorry if Medieval does hear this, but we, we just <laughs> ended up not not yeah. doing it at all. We, we so. might get shot by it's not. It's, just a commentary on our experience as well, because I know I know medieval, and it, it could be this that nostalgia feeling, because I know medieval at the time had a huge, huge following. Yeah, so definitely. Yeah. Nostalgic. I think the game's not bad. It's just it's it just doesn't work for you. Yeah, for the PS4 and the current generation, it's it feels clunky. Yeah, yeah, yeah and that's that's my that's my only criticism. I guess it's not I didn't like the game. It's just that it didn't play very well for me. Yeah, exactly, and that's a fair enough opinion. That's not, that's valid. Um, yeah, I mean, I mean, like you said, like there's games which are remade and are really good, and there's some remakes which have not been. I think there was oh, which game was it that they made? Let me just, if I ever get into it, there was a game that I it was a remake of, and I wasn't really impressed with it, but I completely forgot what it was called. I will come back to it. Uh, Wong, do you have anything? I'll come back to it. I'm thinking what kind of Oh actually Wong you might know one game which we grew up playing uh-huh. and as it got further it for me for this hack and slash game it just ended up going off oh, track a little bit. The Free Kingdom one. Yeah, the the Dynasty Warrior series. Dynasty like Warrior. at the beginning from from one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> That's so many. And maybe yeah, well, it's on nine. At, well, it's on, on nine yeah, at the moment. Nine, yeah. yeah, it's on nine. nine. It's on nine at the yeah. moment. But one, two, three. Number four was my favorite out of all of them. Yeah, same. Number four. Yeah, because the... once they implemented a new move into it, I was absolutely happy. The fourth move, yes. where just everything on the floor just goes in the middle. But except for that, <laughs> like once it once it started once it started hitting five and six and all that, it started getting a little bit five off track. Five is okay. Six is, I think, six is I don't know. star to go on. Or... Yeah, the moment that you can switch weapons in the game, it just felt a little bit different. Like in the old games, you were you all you had to do was get one weapon into the most powerful, like go and do certain stages, which on like like the ultra hard mode to get the weapon. But in yeah. the new one, you can just build it and you can make it so that like you can actually still one shot everything. But in the <laughs> old ones. When you were against the mightiest of all mightiest, oh my, Almighty oh Lu Bu, you still couldn't one shot him. No matter what, you still not one shot him. He would one shot you, so like, but you would not one shot yeah. him. <laughs> Maybe not one shot, two shot. Yeah, still, it depends on what mode you play and how, what your character yeah. was. If you were a newbie and you went up to him, and then like, was... you try to fight him, Especially literally when one he's shot. Angry. <laughs> oh yeah, when, when he's angry. angry. Oh, it, it, it was it was horrible just going up to him. Ever got yeah. anyone that is a, that wants to play Dynasty Warriors is a Dynasty Warrior fan? Do not go up to Lubu. <laughs> He's scary. Or do <laughs> so you've got <laughs> and then learn a learn a very fast fast lesson. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about necessarily like real gaming fails, but I do remember playing. Um, was it? I think it was a Siphon Filler on the original PS. Um. PS gun, so I oh, yeah, okay. and I could yep. not. It was a weird game. It was a weird game. Yeah, I could not. I could not do it to save my life. Or was it two? There's one you had to go around and like taser people out of a prison cell, and I just could not get past that <laughs> level. 
Uh, well, that's how it is, isn't it? Like sometimes, well. like it, it gives you the it gives you like the amazing first game ever, and then like the second game, it can end up being like really weird. Oh, well, I don't mean and, the game was bad. I just think I just couldn't do it. I just I wasn't very great at it. Actually, funny you said like. But again, going back to the PlayStation One game, I don't think I finished Crash Bandicoot One until I was about fourteen, like properly. Cool. So that's that. That's that. If you finish Crash Bandicoot One at one hundred percent, that's when you know you're a true gamer. And I, and that's I legitimate. Yeah, I don't mean the Crash Bandicoot on PS4. I mean the Crash Bandicoot on <laughs> on PS1, and no saving, only passwords. Only passwords, yeah. So Actually, no, mine is mine. Mine is a safe files. I think the um memory card is somewhere. Oh, you got both though. You did both. Oh, did I you did. only complete on the so far? Oh, I did it as proof. <laughs> oh, <laughs> not not anyone can prove it now because you probably can't plug it in anywhere. But it, it's it's uh, saved somewhere. So Grant's got Grant's got a memory card with proof that no one can ever check. <laughs> I got I got two actually. Now think about it. the first one. Santos know which one I'm talking about. It's the Wall Man of the Free Kingdom. Oh yes, yeah. yes, the PC versions. So basically, for for you two, that you, I don't know if you guys remember that game. It's basically like board game. Well, it's not board game. Um, it's sometimes strategy. how you describe? It. Yeah, strategy. strategy. Uh, sim- strategy similar game. to what's the other one? Um, the really famous one. They do something similar, but like different country. Oh, uh, Total um, Kingdom. No, 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 the other one. Total War, Free Kingdom, Total War. Is that Total War? Yeah, yeah, the one where they made the um, they made like a Spartan version, uh, the Rome version. But like, um, the, you start Free from Kingdom like you know at the really early stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. And so then you build up your army and stuff. So it's kind of like that. But and then so it's like the the best one obviously is the eleven one. Yes. And then it's the like as moving on is. It's kind of when, personally, that's I know that they want to kind of continue with like that because what what we're having now, like the the thirteen one, and then they are like more no, the 14th really that old, like. over yeah, over like really old version like the first couple of like one or two three, yeah. like that's kind of style, but I still prefer yeah. the eleven. Um, the second one. Second one, I will say Seven Day to Die. Well, I, I was actually. I don't I was mind looking. the game. I was no, no, I don't mind the game. I was actually looking for it, looking forward to it when these kind of came out, and then it was it was okay, but and then like the storyline. That's not much of the storyline. I, I don't. I think it's supposed to be a story like that. I think it's supposed to be like yeah, you just kind of survive. Yeah, like you know, like Rust. It's kind of like Rust in a zombie it, apocalypse. It's yeah, kind of a, but Daisy but the, and all of that. They were pretty much the same. Yeah, I think that's more the type of game style. I think. Cause, but the thing is, yeah. But the thing is, is because that's that's the main difference between Rust and all those different things. Is because if you look at other things, because they are online. Yeah, but then then Dying Light did that well though. So Dying Dying yeah. Light was like free roaming. You could go and explore and stuff, but you could also you had a story, didn't you? And you could you yeah. could join up and. But the me and you me and you used to play that, didn't we, Lee? Yeah, yeah, we completed the story. Uh, once, almost. once we once we got home and everything. No, I, I, you completed it. I didn't because it got to not? a point where it got to Christmas, didn't it? And I was I was. I was swamped with work. I was working oh, yeah, yeah. So, morning till night. So I messaged you saying that Lee, I can't finish the game with you. Like you have to finish it yourself. And then you went went off and finished it. I still haven't finished it till this day. Oh, have you not? Maybe, <laughs> maybe, that's maybe not. we have to revisit. Maybe we have to do, do oh, a, good. For, uh, a new for? game. Wait, so if do you know? Play. Like I, I reckon if we do a new game, original Dead Island. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really good game, except for like I'm the only one that has it at the moment. Like, funny thing is that I've still got the game, but I still haven't finished it. But Dad's like completed it like 50 times already. This one, yeah, I completed yeah. it as well. Yeah, but not on PlayStation. Oh, no, it. On, yeah, on, I feel like uh, we should Xbox. get it. Us four play it on. Oh yeah, you did get it on Xbox. Yeah, you did. Womp, womp, womp. That's a game and fail. Put it for the wrong good. console. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It was, I, I remember yeah. at the 
at the last part because I like to fold stuff because those if folds you make more damage at the, at because <laughs> once you finish the game like you can keep all your weapon as well so it's oh, yeah. so yeah, yeah. like all oh, this good one <laughs> but at the end of it, like, I can't keep throwing all my weapons so at the end I got no <laughs> just good weapon. I just <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing um but overall it was really good Twelve ninety nine currently on the store. Ah, it's not bad actually. Maybe that's the next after I finish Kingdom Hearts. And and the thing the thing is that not only do you get Dead Island, you get Dead Island definitive. No, so you get the next Dead Island game as well. So you get two games that's for the bad. price of twelve ninety nine. But you don't get Dead Island two. Or is it Dead Island? <laughs> oh come on, Lee. Let's not go back into that. Otherwise, <laughs> my rant, my rant will go on forever. Uh, I don't know if Lee remembers this one. Actually, I think it might have happened to you, or maybe me. I thought we shared a safe art at the time. But it was, um, again, g- going back in the past, for Tomb Raider, The Angel of Darkness. Oh, God damn For whatever it. reason, oh, I don't know how this was me. programmed it was in the me. game. It was me. It was you. I, I think it was me. one of us. And I, I don't even know why this wasn't programmed oh, in the game. So annoying. I think Lee side-flipped by accident, because the, the controls were a bit dodgy, yep. over, over an edge. Yep. And he obviously naturally went to... Oh, reload. Pause. Reload. But the game let him save <laughs> mid air. In mid air on my so own every... save file. Yeah. So you literally overwrote the save file within mid flip, so you could never recover. And every oh. time you reloaded the game, you'd finish the flip and and die. And die. So and and should, and you have like the the Lara Croft's natural scream. So uh, like the reload is. Uh, 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 and and I was about what like, was it a quarter way halfway through the game? Probably um, halfway, I imagine. Yeah, I think it's more like halfway. Um, and after that, I've I've just like I didn't play it for a good ten years until um, <laughs> my sister got it back on PC over Christmas, and I played it. I then I borrowed it and played it over Christmas, completed it. But I was just like so annoyed. And I had it on like the PlayStation. I never played it for ten years after that because it's like goddamn this safe so <laughs> it, it was just so funny how you reacted to that. It, it just sounded you were so triggered. The moment was, that Grant said they said the game, you were so triggered. It was like as triggered as I was about Dead Island Two. <laughs> it's like this is my like this is my version of the rant is. That has terrible coding to let you. Yeah. Well, well, this game. One, I'm stupid for <laughs> saving over my own save file. <laughs> it asks you about. But it only asks you once uh, do you want to overwrite the save file? It doesn't ask you like two or three times, like most games that do now. So, I know, though, I did enjoy the game actually when I played it back, when I played it back through the second time. I actually like the story, even though everyone hates it. It's like one of the worst games in history, apparently. It's not that bad. I quite liked it. And the storyline's really good. Hmm. The controls were dodgy, and it lets you save as you jump over a ledge. But <laughs> <laughs> this is this is this is my uh, my rant, Santos. <laughs> Actually, uh, everyone, everyone, has, everyone has their own rants. Don't worry. Yeah, because I, I remember there's like well, uh, it wasn't say game breaking like <laughs> Tomb Raider, but it was again for a modern game, pre- pretty dodgy that they let it in. But I was playing Pokemon Sun and Moon at the time, and on release they gave you a gift Munchlax <laughs> and um, as you know Munchlax is normal type but it has, has access to, to metronome um, and for people who don't know metronome is a, a random move it can generate one of hundreds or, you know it could be anything but you're not guaranteed to get a good move um, and stupidly I went into battle and the lady had a ghastly and I thought okay that's fair enough I'll use metronome I need the XP not thinking normal doesn't affect ghost and ghost doesn't affect normal and this ghastly <laughs> is me <literally. laughs> Seriously, no. The disgusting. And I've checked and read it, and people have done the same thing as me. Yeah. So it wasn't just me. So what, you stuck in was... a battle, or is it? Is it a trainer battle? Uh, so you a trainer be... battle. Oh, I was... so, you, so you're just stuck. Yeah, <laughs> and because the, the ghastly used me. Look, I can switch my Pokemon. That's that's a problem. My only damaging move to the ghastly was Metronome. But again, that counts on the fact of you know making hit moves, yeah. which it did yes. not. The ghastly can attack me because it used like lick and curse and stuff yes. like that. Uh... And literally for like 50 turns out of the way until we struggle each other to death. <laughs> I literally had to put the, the console on charge so I didn't lose my save for the rest. That's like the worst. The worst it's a stalemate. ever. Yeah, yeah, you're just in a stalemate. That's how you do a stalemate, turns. guys. Munch back against Ghastly until you're stuck. Read on Reddit afterwards, honestly. People, I'm, I'm quite surprised it did. It's, it's an odd you know, set of events that leads to it, obviously. Yeah. But, but then it's, it's one of them things that, like, how would you ever test that? 
<laughs> yeah, I know. We just come across it. Just by like chance. It. But more than one person's done it. I tell you mm. what, game. It's not really game and fail because it was quite successful. But um, I was so bad at it. Um, PS1 Driver. It was a weird game. Dri- you ripped yeah. my car. Get out of my sight. <laughs> yeah, you ripped my car. Get out of my sight. It was a weird game, but like I can never get part of the tutorial level. So, so we just sort of used to go into like the the multiplayer bit where you could just oh, yeah. the free the free room. Is it multiplayer or free room bit? Where you just drive around and just get police chasing you. And <laughs> That's what we to do. Because <laughs> we couldn't get the tutorial, and I still haven't passed it to this day. It's it was just it's just so weird. It's hard. It's impossible. Okay, this isn't a fail or anything, it was really successful, but this was a game that me and Wong spent so much time on, it was on the PS2, and it was uh, Sims 2. Sims 2, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, Sims 2 was so good. It was so it was, it, was, it, was, it wasn't because it was, you get to only build your house, like, in the 3D view. it was that because you actually was your character. Yeah, you, you can, actually, like, you can you control, no, no, you control. You, yeah, you controlled like, your character. Because obviously, like, like, the typical Sims is like you click on that thing and then you do something. No, this time you are like you control, like you go, like you you move Run to yeah, you, you you literally you are using him oh. instead of like clicking on oh talk to her, do that. No, you yeah, so click on her. On you, PS... you walk up to her and then PlayStation. do those stuff. Yeah, on, on PlayStation, PlayStation yes. Yeah, your character was a third. You were playing in a third-person view, so oh, you played okay. as a third-person instead of actually where you were just clicking on a mouse, saying that go walk over to just uh, press the uh, button. Yeah. For that person to slowly walk over, so you can change to another character. In this one, you actually walked over to it, and you um you actually walked around using the analog to the person, start talking or start working out and everything like that. When you had to go to work, you go to work. <laughs> and there's some characters that you can be so that because there's new areas that you can lock, so you have to play as certain characters. Yeah, yeah, to and unlock. do their missions to oh, unlock the cool. next area. So whenever yeah. me and Wong, because this was so funny, whenever this happened, me and Wong always picked the same job. I was always <laughs> was always to do with law. And he was always to do with crime. So I was the police officer. <laughs> <laughs> Just Wong, Wong. Wong was a mafia oh, yeah. boss. <laughs> that was literally what it was. But at one, it was at so one point, we were like, the the job level was like the top. So we like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. went up to like top. And I was like Supreme Justice or something. Or something like that. It was so funny. Insane. <laughs> we were raking in money so much. Like, and the other, the, thing, the other thing what made that game better than any other games at the moment is it can multiplayer yeah it's cool it can multiplayer that. that's simple as that yeah, like even play. now the fourth okay. one the fourth one you cannot do multiplayer no you can't so yeah the fourth one you can't it was released on PSN the fourth one and it's and it's it's more like it's more like the PC version so I never ever played Sims 2 on PC it took a long time to install <laughs> but then like the first Back thing I why the first the first time I played it, the house set alight and by accident, <laughs> I made a carpet and thought, yeah, I put this nice rug next to the, near the fireplace, thinking, yeah, it looks really nice. Not realizing middle of the night, the rug catches a light, and my Sims are too they got too scared, um, so they couldn't put out the fire, <laughs> and it just burned. <laughs> <to death. laughs> I was like, god damn it! It was it was really good. It's a game and fail. I guess fail is like the the Sims, well, West of the Sims, except Sims Two. It's not even no that the one that we play. It wasn't Sims Two. It was, it was on GameCube. Not GameCube. Yeah, it is on GameCube. No, no, no. There was a PS Two version, and then I bought the game a, a GameCube version, which was really funny because back then we had some friends which were going through some stuff, and then one of the <laughs> this was all my fault to be honest, actually. <laughs> to be honest, everything. <laughs> I can't anyway. But then I had one of my missions, Wong, do you remember this? One of my missions that I had to start a love triangle <laughs> with someone. Oh, wow. and, then, and, and then this happened, and then there was me who was spreading rumours at school about these people, which I didn't even go to school back then. <laughs> I didn't. Even, I wasn't in school, I was in college, so I don't even know how this... And then, like, things got out of hand, and then, like, 
it, it was just at the end of the day, everything went fine, and but it was quite funny. <laughs> them rumors spread to I, us. I, them rumors spread. <laughs> That's all I was saying. That really? <laughs> Life imitates <it's> hearts. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> um, mm. What other? So, I think we haven't got too much to sort of say other than the game of fails. Any? Anyone got any other topics or? Actually, no. Actually, talking about game fails, there's one one oh, game have... that I uh, I do have one. It wasn't so much to do with the game; it was so much to do with how the format of the game was. And uh, for me, that was uh, Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. Or the one on GameCube that we on the, the GameCube, Game yeah. Uh, don't Game get Cube. me wrong; I love the game. Like you had to carry a crystal around. You can play in fours and everything like that. Like the best thing about like you mix magic. Like there was a little circle icon, and if one uses ice, the one uses fire, it makes gravity. Or if you two use the fire, it makes a bigger fire and everything like that. Like <clears throat> it, I, I loved it. But it's just the format of you have to buy four cables Hell to yeah. link with four game a Game Boy Advance. That's if you had a Game Boy Advance. Just so that you can actually play multiplayer on there. Yeah, you only need mm-hmm. one game though, which is which is nice. Yeah, you only need one game, but like buying the game. But uh, I think most, they, but just buying the cable one and everything like that back in the day. Yeah, it's it an was, awkward setup, wasn't it? it was, yeah, it was an awkward setup, and like once you finish playing and everyone goes home, you try to clear it up, and they're already tangled because <laughs> because it gets a little bit intense. <laughs> too, too many cables. It's too intense. Or too many cables. Yeah. There, there's a reason for that, like a, like an actual electronic reason, and that's the like oh, yeah, yeah. the magnetic field in them, and that's why your yeah. iPhone, because like for some reason I don't know why, but iPhone cables are, are like give off, will create uh, create a stronger magnetic field, so they get really tangled really quickly. <laughs> that's the I reason. That. Yeah, I, that's the that's the simple version. There's there's more complicated than that, but that's the reason. So- I just for the cable gremlins that do it when you're not looking. Oh cable yeah, gremlins. cable gremlins. <laughs> less, less messed up the mind. Yeah. Let's do this again. I don't know if it's a fail in particular, because again, I did enjoy the game as a whole, but um, for some reason, I've really committed to getting platinum to it, and that was Assassin's Creed uh, number three. And uh, for what oh, reason? Oh, Assassin's Creed now. That's a good one <laughs> to go on. Anyway, go on, you go, you go first. And actually, uh, it was, uh, it's not let's put me off the series, but that w- one game I've only pl- ever played one game since, and that's Assassin's Creed Syndicate. And that's a few a few years later. Syndicate was good though. Syndicate was good, like that. But free, it, it was such a hard platinum to get, and I think it is probably my rarest because no one else can be bothered to do it. But, it's... but the game is glitchy. There's lots of. Yeah, pointless task. It just wasn't very. It was so glitchy. The storyline well doesn't out. really work. The, the like the storyline's good as a whole, but it, it doesn't fit in the open worldness of it. Or they haven't. Uh, they, like they they're like let's make a bit massive open world, and yeah, that's good. But if there's no real purpose to it, you're just like it's a waste of time. You have missions to go and yeah. find this, hunt something. <laughs> As I think, I know it's probably ahead of its time that you, you got Red, Red, Dead, Red, sorry, Red Dead Redemption 2 now, which obviously does it better. But I think there's never any patches to improve on bits. The game was just left as it was. No, no. But but then they improved on it with, well, it's not really an Assassin's Creed game, but Black Flag, which is basically the best pirate game I've ever played. Oh, yeah, I do remember them, actually. Assassin's, on the ships. Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. It's not. People, mm. people forget it's Assassin's Creed because it's like um, you're basically open seas and you're a pirate, but it is an Assassin's Creed game, and but it, it feels like a pirate fight. No, and, there, was, there was there was only two Assassin's Creed, and that was number one and number two, and that was it. <laughs> everything, else was, Black, everything else was just not Assassin's Creed. Yeah, Black Flag is its own game, really, to be honest. But it is good, so I give them that. And, just playing as Altair and playing as Ezio, the two main characters Ezio. from one and two. That was, was that, that was literally like after two was really good. I think I played, I played number two before I played number one, but that was one of my first games that I got Assassin's Creed two. So like I was really happy with that game and everything. Once again, the, the funny fact about this one, uh, Assassin's Creed two, me and, me and Dad started the game at the same time, but Dad completed the game before me again. <laughs> so. <laughs> so. You have a g- gamers in a family, and your dad's better than you. <laughs> oh, yeah, 
lot. When it comes to like zombie games and everything like that, he is definitely a lot better than me. Yeah. But other than that, I would say like all the other Assassin's Creed, unfortunately, in my opinion, were flops and fails. Unfortunately, unfortunately, Black- like, they didn't have they didn't have the same impact that number one and two gave. Yeah, true. Edward. And number one had Kristen Bell. Yes. Had Anna. Had Anna. Number two had Anna as well. That's right. But spoiler. She may die. You didn't hear from me. The game is quite old. (laughs) Oh, dear. (laughs) I was actually mate. I think, in my opinion, what I felt was one of the... uh, uh, Through voice acting... At the range of um, characters that there were to me to this day, I think it's still um, uh, Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts, yeah. Well, Only because mm, there's can... so ma- there's yeah. so many characters in it that they use different. It's like the third one in, in the latest one, Kingdom Hearts Three. I'm not going to spoil it yet because Lee's still playing. But there's so many characters. Which I just search up, and then I was like, I'm, "Really? I'm one... Is that? Oh my god! Really?" I'm only just finished Pirates, so I'm basically on. So you're going to um, San San Francisco, uh, friends, and big big Hero Six. San Franco, San Franco. That's the one. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really hard word to it's say. Right. It's all right. I'm here. That's all. Right. Don't worry. I've always wondered that. Do they keep the original voice actors for uh, for most Kingdom Hearts? for for most? They try to. They they try to. They they try to except for. I think her, so because they get older through the series, so th- some voices have changed because of age. Yeah, and Mickey Mouse is different as well one year. because the yeah. ori- the original guy that voiced him um, died, um, so I had to change him. So there's, there's, actually, there's actually a few who has actually died as well through Kingdom Hearts as well. Um, a good one, Lee. I can actually say this to you because you probably know by now because you've played yeah. all the others, and that is um, Xehanort. Zayn Hort's voice actor also died as well. Yeah, well, Leonard. No, Leonard Nimoy was alive, isn't he? No. No, no, he did. He, he died. Said. Yeah, Zayn He he died. Unfortunately, this was unfortunate for the whole whole thing. Is that he died before Kingdom Heart Three was released? Oh yeah, yeah. See, so yeah, people yeah. people were quite upset when they heard that he died before the game got released. Was he did tell. He did film some lines in it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, which is a bit of a shame. No, but talk, yeah. talking of it does bring back to one more game of fail. Um, I quite like the voice acting in general for Kingdom Hearts Three, apart from the pirates world. Jack Sparrow, good. Will Turner, questionable, but I let it pass. <laughs> Elizabeth Swan, supposed to be English. She sounds Australian, or she sounds like an American trying to do a British accent while sounding Australian, and then at halfway decides to change to Australian because that's working better. <laughs> And it's yeah, the yeah, worst exactly. voice acting I've ever heard in the entire game. <laughs> it, it, yeah, some of the stuff was really, really weird. That was that was really bad. It was it was like it was like game and fail slash classic meme moment. Jill <laughs> sandwich moment. Oh, you said you beat me to it. I was going <laughs> to say the same thing then. Uh, Resident Evil Jill sandwich. Oh, Jill that was sandwich. I almost became not Jill just the sandwich. sandwich. <laughs> Just in general, the whole game and the lines that it had was really bad. What was it? The Take gameplay this. was amazing. The game Barry. was amazing. It's just, just Take stuff. this. Yeah. That, that was, was a was close weird. one. Are you Master of a chill sandwich. Oh. Oh, Barry. Oh, oh, Barry. Looks like you're the master of unlocking. <laughs> it's like it's just like it's really cheesy lines and that's the original PS1 game and they did they did change it up for the remastered one didn't they still they, was bad it was yeah. still bad because they tried still to was, because it's a mean moment so they can't out they can't write it out but they did try and change the yeah. word on a bit <laughs> didn't uh, say funny it. say it because I was, I was going to mention that actually but I think the game was literally translated from the Japanese version the original was yeah yeah a lot yeah that's yeah. why it sounds odd like word for word. <laughs> yeah. Actually, talking about bad, another bad voice acting. Final Fantasy X. Final Fantasy X. Titus, his voice compared to the Japanese one was so bad, but then the ending just cleared everything off. I mean, you guys probably haven't played the game before, no, or haven't no. completed. 
but the ending was so good compared to the Japanese version. But the voice of the Japanese version, Titus, was much better than the English one. It just made him, the English version, sorry whoever uh, had done the voice <laughs> for him, it just made him sound so whiny. So it was just whining all the time. I'm just checking, but it is... Oh, he's actually quite a famous voice actor. He's um, James he was... Arnold Taylor, who did Ratchet in Ratchet and Clank series. Oh, ah, okay. He was, but still, he was just... Yeah, it's one of his early Before... ones. One of his early. I oh, know, wasn't he done? A... He's done quite a lot, to be honest. There's a lot of TV oh, shows. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, funny you say it about voice acting because I I did find this recently as well. But SpongeBob SquarePants is the voice of Spyro. Yes. Or Spyro is the voice of SpongeBob. Yeah, exactly. But it's 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 some, but voice actors do a lot of like have a lot of range. So a lot of like um. Like Leon Kennedy used to be um, Matt Mercer until the later series when they decided mm. to, they wanted a younger sounding guy. It, Matt Mercer could do a younger sounding guy, so I think it's a bit unfair. But like, um, like he he's in so many different like he's in Monster Hunter as well as like the um, commander that gives you missions. Okay, fair enough. And like, so many voice actors just to like such a range. Uh, okay, yeah. Lee, do you know who voice acted um, Aqua in Kingdom Hearts 3? Yeah. Um, Fia from Arrow, or as yeah, yeah. her actual name, Willow Hollands. Um, everyone hates her voice acting, but I actually like her voice acting. Her... I didn't know it was. Oh, shit, actually, no, now, now it's coming to my head. No, it is. Her. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> now it's coming back. <laughs> I think that's part of the um, uh, where the Step on Me memes came from. For that one, but yeah. that's, that's a conversation for another time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's amazing. That's for another time. <laughs> no, no, no. She, she's the, she's the voice for. It's in Birth by Sleep as well. She's the voice in Birth by Sleep and and the New Kingdom Hearts three, as far as I'm aware. Um, I just, yeah, I didn't actually good. know. So I like her voice acting. A lot of people hate it and said it is it's a bit flat and stuff. No, but I, I think it's more the character's design. I enjoyed it. I wish I had more Excellent. lines. But... <laughs> What's that, Grant? I, to... oh, I was saying this. I know um, Laura Bailey was Helena from Resident Evil 6. Oh, yeah, yeah. And, and Matt Mercer was Leon Kennedy in the oh, same so was... game. <laughs> so they met then. Well, they must have met before. No, no, they, small industry. They, knew, they knew each other before. Um, for some reason a voice acting community is it's large but also everyone seems to know each other <laughs> I was thinking it's quite tight knit well, yeah because they probably get called in to do like a voice of one line if that makes sense so the yeah. people you must meet is ridiculous Leon Helena oh no that's wrong that's the wrong voice sorry shut <laughs> up <laughs> yeah no but that's um so yeah, any other topics or the only thing I can think of again it's it's not again it's not a fail because actually the game is really good. Um, it's more like a Dead Island two thing where it, it would never see the light of day, and it's the PT demo. Oh, yeah. oh Silent Hill PT. Silent Hill PT. Yeah, is it playable teaser? I can't remember what it stands for, yeah, but play, yeah, play exactly. But, but I think they've actually. Oh, sorry, so I think they've actually pulled it from the the network now. Yeah, you can't get it. So if you've downloaded it, you can still download it, I think. But if you oh, okay. if you haven't downloaded it, you cannot um, go back and download it. It's off the network because they've lost the rights to it. Ah, uh, I thought yeah, I thought it'd be something like that. Yeah, it was because he got um, the, the 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 guy that made Death Stranding did um, PT um, and originally made it as an it's like a follow up on Silent Hill, and mm -hmm. it is it's a fact that the game and fail is the fact that it's not come out. <laughs> oh yeah, that's something. It's more like a, a no, I failed expectation. With, the game is very scary. No, because obviously the copyright. Then obviously uh, after that, he just left the company. He just like fuck it. Yeah, there's too much studio interference. Uh, it's like now, nah, yeah, there's an argument. I was, I'm sure, but like inside, they probably had a you know creative kind of difficulty. Creative difficulty, kind just of. A... Yeah, with the whole thing and yeah, exactly. But it, but it's so, but it's so good that um, even in in the playable teaser, if you break the camera 
and then have a look around, the ghost of the person you're trying to find is always following you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> mm, I've heard that. And so apparently, if you, so the idea of it, I think, the, well, I'm not 100% sure on this, but I think the idea of it was if you were walking in and come across like a mirror, the mirrors were supposed to be programmed so you see yourself and you see a figure in the mirror behind you, then you turn around and it won't yeah, be there. And, and like, sure. and that'll be throughout the whole game. So you, you're basically just got this. As soon as you see that one, you're like, "I've got this feeling that someone's following me all the time now." <laughs> oh, I, uh, it would have been so good if they've released it VR so that Lee could play it. Oh no! It would have been. <laughs> it would have, some, yeah. some, it would have some, been the some best recording did. we could have had. <laughs> some people actually make that. Yeah, yeah they they remade make it. Make the VR. VR, but I think that's yeah on the PC. On PC, yeah. Uh, well, Santa, I was talk, talking of but VR game and fails. Do you want to explain? <laughs> it wasn't a fail. It was not a fail. It was the best it was ever. Fail. It, was, it fail. was so funny. I've never seen something so funny in my life. So there <laughs> I was, because um, I went over to Lee's once because I got bored. So I was just like, Lee, you free? And then he was like, yeah. So I was like, I'm going over. We'll play on the PS4. He was like, okay. So I went over to his. <laughs> and then like we, uh, what when I got there, he was like, I've downloaded this new game, like it's called Impatient, and um, it it's a scary game, and I I, I kind of <laughs> want to do it for the channel, so I was just like, okay, okay, I'll have a little look into it. So before we actually um, done the recording, Lee had a quick go on it, so I was just like, okay, so, so Lee could like understand the basic on how to move and what to do and like what it is about and everything like that. So we got to like probably five minutes into the game. <laughs> then um, something, something happens in the game, which I'm not going to spoil because we actually have recorded it. So I'll let you guys uh, as watch it yeah. when you get a chance. But then, like, there was this scary bit. Well, it was, I won't call it scary, but it was more of a jump scare. It's not scary at all. It was me. more. It's scary. It was, it was scary for you. It was scary for you. But it was a jump scare. There I was just sitting, minding my own business because I was on my phone and everything like that. Next thing I see, it's just Lee going backwards because his TV and his sofa is like quite close to each other so he fell he went backwards fell on his sofa I had to quickly <laughs> jump off because otherwise he would have crushed me I literally had to quickly jump off and then I could, I could not stop laughing he was so scared that he just fell over and just dropped the controller <laughs> I was in hysterics I laughed so much in my life I wish I was able to record that. I didn't get the recording oh, of no. it. It would have been so funny. That was one of the funniest thing I've seen. I know. We'll, 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 and to be honest, we will have. I will film film that. But I think I think for the, this kind of game to work in the recording, you need to see my reaction because me and horrors. Like I, I can play horrors, and it was fine, but. Oh, does it freak me out? And you need to see my reaction as well, rather than. So unfortunately, I haven't been able to film any more episodes during the lockdown. But you kind of want to film that when we're yeah, when allowed it, to. When, uh, we, once we're allowed to, we'll get back onto it and everything like that. Two, two person moment, setup. The only, <laughs> that we can really record is either our own games at the moment, or because there isn't much multiplayer games that's just been Not released. Online. No, no, exactly. Online. Like we've been playing a lot of Apex, but you guys have seen a lot of Apex stuff already. Anyway, yeah. oh, I've got um, one last. It's not really a game and fail, but it's a fail from our channel. What? Okay. <laughs> Wong saying, "Oh uh, yeah, Lee." At the end of our intro video, we talked about it a bit last <laughs> week. To be honest, so I don't want to go back that into too much. Fail. But that wasn't that's an, the ultimate fail for our channel. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Wong. In the funny, the funniest fail. Put it that way. <laughs> yeah, but back, but no. Back, back to what you're saying, uh, Sanos. There's not that many online games at the moment. That much at the moment. Like I don't know, Grant, if you've tried it or not. But um, the new Resident Evil Resistant that comes part of the game when you buy Resident Evil Three as well. Oh yes, it's it's been downloaded, but I've not tried it yet. I think it's a really weird game and everything like that. Like I'm sure it'll come out as a single. It has um, to, though. Game by yourself, but at the moment that I've I've played it, trophies are quite hard to get. Number one, and um, a lot of people just end up quitting after um, you go into second phase, which I'm not. I'm not. I don't understand why people do that. Like I haven't actually successfully finished the game. 
Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> no, monkeys. Because people can leave yeah. I guess they'll patch it so yeah. you can't leave or you'll get like a penalized if you do or something. And yeah. They'll, they'll figure something out for that. But, but I just... Kind of, kind of like what they do with Apex in right yeah. match matches. Yeah, yeah. If you quit, then you get a 10-minute You're locked band. out 10 minutes. Which is... I didn't know that, though. <laughs> Until I done it once. <laughs> and then I was you like... Quit. Oh, God, damn it. You quit! You <laughs> quit! <laughs> no. But sometimes your teammates do make you rage in that game. Like, there are times where me and Lee would be like, oh, let's do this. Like, it'll get to the point where me and Lee... We, because me and Lee's been playing quite a lot lately. Me and him will get to, like, top three, top four, or like that. Every single and time. And then it's just him. But then because they have an extra player on their team... We get surrounded, and then we look. Well, my internet connection has been bad anyway, but still, like it, it's it's just we we're always that one person short on giving us a hand. Yeah, exactly. But then, there was one we were doing the other day. It was like oh, we had the best like advantage and stuff like that. And as I was shooting, I fell off the edge. <laughs> but I like landed right in front of the bad guy. But of course, they was, they they had the same idea as us. And so they spread out on the ground. But it was, that was the worst fight. Actually, we, we were lucky. Yeah, I did kill it. I did kill one, but then the other guy shot me from behind, and then Salas dropped down, and yeah. he lagged, and then lost us the game. I blame yeah, Salas pretty much. <laughs> yeah, actually no, I'm blaming the other guy. If he didn't rush, yeah, yeah, our third player it rushed early on. We're like, no, what are you doing? He's gonna die, and then died like two seconds later. <laughs> that was a game. He's just stuck. If he stuck with us, we would have been fine. Yeah, you know what the worst thing, what the funniest thing was about that one was that like he quit. Even though we're top three, he would have got points for it, but he's just quit. Yeah, I know. On a ranked match as well. <laughs> just, <laughs> yeah, just, yeah, just like just, just, just watch. Hmm. Yeah. Like, don't have to watch. Like just go away somewhere and come back. You'll get more points, and won't be locked out for ten yeah. minutes. Maybe you rage quit. That is true. <laughs> it's, Maybe he did. He's he probably thinking like, <laughs> it's not our fault. I don't know. That's. Not too bad, but like you're saying, like there's not too many online games other than the other than the, the typical ones. Like they are fun to play and stuff, but I remember not now, but like remember when we was playing a lot of GTA. Yes, yes. We was we was so angry because like because we're doing the heist, and then like because sometimes Grant was not online a lot back then. Or you still now? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> busy. <laughs> so, so sometimes just few of us. So me, Santos, and Lee, just kind of playing it. So it's like the highest is four people, and then one of the people like quit. Oh yeah. Or it's too hard, and then we have to restart the whole thing now. But back that was yeah. Back but then, then. That but was then don't forget about that. Like, the main thing was that every time we invited someone, they just. They we always played every heist on hard, the hardest difficulty that there was. Yeah, yeah. The hardest well, why not? that you get, the more money you get as well. So that's what we wanted to do it that way. But people just came in, then found out that oh my god, like this is really hard, and then they just quit. And I'm just like, I think we it's just got it got to a point where me and Wong when when we when we when we first met, we were still playing games at normal difficulty. Then we just got to a point where we thought like. Even when we get a new game, playing on hard mode is more fun than it it's is playing on hard. Oh, I, I play every game on hard now. Like Kingdom Hearts is yeah. hard. And, yeah. Um, it's just, it's just, it makes it much more fun. Yeah, but I shop yeah. hard. Can I, can I also say something? Yeah. Because I've been, because I've been start playing GTA again. Now, oh, if yeah. they make it like, if you are doing heist, if you quit, it's fine. If like one person quit, two person quit. One person, three, three, three people quit. Doesn't matter. Oh, you can as long continue. as you can still continue, even the last one. But again, hard. That is super hard. <laughs> um, hard. Especially, yeah, especially now with those heights. I mean, I I re-downloaded it because I just wanted to see what it's like uh, online. So I added some updates and stuff. So I re-downloaded it. But I mean, if you have three people to do it, maybe. maybe I mean, I'm awesome. asked for it. Yeah. <laughs> if, if you guys <laughs> want to get it. get yeah. on get on again. Um, I can I can do it again. You got to download uh, it's it. Just that... What are the updates? By the way, I just oh, I just, yeah. just, just, yeah. just want to let you know. Make sure you delete most of your game because that <laughs> game is is one hundred fifty gigabyte. Oh my god! Are you <laughs> 60 gigabyte? 
Oh, really? I'm just oh, saying. That. I haven't oh, installed all the updates. Do, so. I'm up for it, but I haven't installed all the updates. So. I can delete everything. <laughs> yeah, same. I got a terabyte. Yeah, I think, I think you need to spend a whole week downloading. No, I did it. I've done it already. So I'm, I'm halfway. Oh, I'm halfway it. there. I just need to do the last update. that's 50 gigabytes. <laughs> <laughs> so. I wonder how long it'll take me. Um, five days. My internet's been really. My internet's been really bad. <laughs> Mine is actually. Yeah, that's, 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 that's because they've reduced bandwidth as well, and also people keep going around destroying all these masts. What mast? Five G oh. masts, internet masts. Oh, because oh, pe- do they? Yeah, because people gone, people gone crazy and gone. Oh, yeah. coronavirus is radiation poisoning, even though symptoms are because entirely of 5G. different because of five G. Because of the five G. So they're it's burning. Crazy. But, but then some people are burning masts down. <laughs> exactly. Some people are burning internet stations down which have nothing to do with 5g <laughs> they just <laughs> transmit whatever's on the ground so people so, are just going crazy so What's grant, you know, grant do you know no know, know about these things no so basically it's like yeah. a th- it's like a theory that people believe conspiracy well, at least, uh, cons- some people believe that the the virus was kind of passing through through radiation, so see five G <laughs> as a okay. big thing because it's is it getting or are they? I, I don't know. Is it well, yeah, because yeah, because China or it not? was, it was bec- the the reason it spread was because China was a testing bed for five G. Okay, in Wuhan <laughs> is is a coincidence. Right. It's a coincidence, and viruses do not work this way. Everything yeah. is a coincidence. It's, it's like, become a digital. <laughs> are we are we a computer now? <laughs> it's like we robots. Science. Guys. I think science. <laughs> I think the funniest thing has to be when the announcement of coronavirus came out, and then someone rearranged a word and it made the word Raccoon City. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <Everyone won Raccoon. laughs> and then they just linked it all together. Yes, the zombie apocalypse is starting right now. But, but you say that, Sadars, but because of that, I, ha- I um, so we played yeah. the evil. I don't know if you've managed to have a chance to watch it, but in the first like bit, I've had to put in yeah, a, a warning. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. it's like oh, it's not a oh, commentary. You know, and, no. and do you know what, why people are saying it's all linked as well? Because when they first. Um, found out about the uh, coronavirus and everything like that. It was in this, um, I think it was in a hospital or it was in a university or something like that that they were doing. It was and then the, 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 No, no, not the, only that, but the symbol of the logo was the umbrella. <laughs> yeah, it was like, except for it was umbrella logo, except for it was blue and white. Blue or something, yeah. Yeah. Red, yeah. <laughs> so everyone's saying, this is not a coincidence. This is not a drill. <laughs> that's, that, that's the lemon we had as well. And in the games, it's uh, spread in Wuhan, so that's why people made that link. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I don't want to spread conspiracies, but that's a more plausible link than 5G spreads radiation. Yeah, that's more <laughs> that's plausible. Ridiculous. Five... <laughs> and coronavirus and radiation sickness are entirely different situations. Like, different symptoms. <laughs> yeah. Different, definitely a lot more different. But uh, talking about that raccoon sticking and everything like that, I was just thinking, like, if this was has ended up being it, do you reckon you would have survived? What like, me? Uh, like a zombie like apocalypse? A zombie. Not a zombie apocalypse. Like, let's just say this this has turned into the T virus, and like, well, you know, suppose... would you have? Do you reckon you would have survived? Uh yeah, I think so. I yeah, like because I pick and choose when I go for walks. So there's no one around, and <laughs> there's open fields nearby what? me. Lee, Lee, this is a zombie apocalypse. Like, it's not open fields or anything like that. Zombies are alive now. Like, oh, they are, are coming. Are for we you. talking slow zombies <laughs> or fast zombies, though? Because that makes a difference. Uh, well, well, everything's about raccoon now, right now, isn't it? So, Resident Evil, um, Resident yeah, Evil Three, Infer- Inferno status zombies. So they're more aggressive and they come after you. Yeah. Um. When they when they see you, they will come after you I'm straight out of away. Weapons. Like they. And the the only shop nearby me is is like a small corner shop, so it's not going to be enough to get what I need. <laughs> I'm out of weapons. <laughs> so I'm out of weapons, but I'm very secluded, so I might survive if I stay away from town. <laughs> I would probably break into the nearby college. I might yeah. do. I mean, that's not a bad idea. I barricade myself because I I, I can let the stones throw away. And, and then and then you'll meet up with Sanos, so then you then you power in numbers, strength in numbers. Yeah, but doing doing that you doing that college got it's like a 
massive glass her windows yes <laughs> windows. oh yeah that's true so you just yeah. no but it, but it reinforced so like it'd just be like the zombies just peering at it so you just never had to sleep but there's lots of chairs and stuff and <laughs> tables and yeah. back yeah. tables like, and you have a canteen have, like, so you might have enough food for like oh. a while a couple of weeks a week or two if you ration it and I'm not gonna lie it has like wood workshops and electric workshops and everything like that yeah but you need yes, to know so you need to come save me first and take me with you I don't really need knowledge. I have got this is, knowledge of uh, all of it. This is the plan. I mean, if you if you somehow can make it, I'm not going to come and save you, Lee. If you somehow can make it, I'm not quite far away. This is my friends. Uh, yeah. this is my friends. Go. They're I'm saying not... uh, you you have to fend for yourself, and unless you make it, then we'll help you out. But <laughs> fend for yourself until funny, then. Lee. I'm not being funny, but from where you live oh, no. to the college, it takes a bit of time. Away. I'm not risking my life for that. It's half an hour walk across <laughs> fields, possibly. Well, we could send us. There's a supermarket, no names mentioned, not far from me, either. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there is. There is. Nah, but yeah, super, yeah. supermarket's always risky because you, you tend to run into people. And so I'm like, I'm well, not sure. people. Your first stop has to. <laughs> no, no, but your first stop has to be supermarket to get all your gear first. Toilet paper. Get, yeah, to get toilet paper and then get out. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Zombie apocalypse, I need toilet paper. <laughs> mm. Well, I mean. I think that's people's mindsets now. It's crazy, isn't it? <laughs> that's the least of my worries. My first, my first bit is get to a hardware store because, like, nail yeah. guns, whatever, hammer, and all hammer, this stuff. makeshift bow and arrow. <laughs> I reckon. I'm... No, to be honest, like, what? I mean, I'm a little better. I can just go into my garage and grab whatever I've got before I leave. It's a little bit harder for you two mainly because you both live in flats so you won't really have like stuff to put inside like a, a shed or anything to put inside so at least if I go to my back I can get like a sledgehammer some, for some reason I have a sledgehammer in my house <laughs> uh, but I have a car so I mean like petrol would be a problem for a while but I have a car and I can drive so I, I at least can get to you quite quickly that is true yeah so I'll be alright actually true. And then we could stop We could pick up loads of gear, and that could be our thing. But we just need to get a load of fuel. I, think I just need to work out. Store the gear in the car, and then I drive the car. I'm your getaway drivers. Oh yeah. <laughs> I actually, we had this discussion oh, before, didn't we? I just thought of another game and fell. Uh, carry on, Sanas, but I'll, I'll tell you my other game and fell. Yeah, but um, we had this discussion. We were just like, would you go and say who? Who would you go to first out of? The- the, the us lot obviously unfortunately it, when we had this discussion Wong was always our last option I mean, only because he's Wong, in, Wong's in Wong's in London heavily but let's just say <laughs> yeah no, so chance of, I talked about the T-Virus so not the coronavirus yeah yeah like <laughs> if, if Wong had a chance of escaping that it would have been very slim as well but in the town we're in then See, who quite, would you go to first? Who would I go to first? Yeah. But you, you two would be safe. I would go get Wong first because he's technically the furthest away. So the quicker I get Wong and bring him back to like the college or yeah. the supermarket, then yeah. uh, we're safer. So that'd be my plan. I would get him to bring him back in. You try and get into the college and hold ground and make sure no one else comes in that is distrustworthy. I'll, I'm just gonna be honest with you. I probably wouldn't survive. So by the time I get out the door, I probably would have been munched by the zombies already. So, <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, my luck. <laughs> no, my luck. My <laughs> luck. That's my plan anyway. I'd say Wong first, then ho- hoping that Sanderson and Grant had. It still depends if they make it into <laughs> some kind of bunker. Yeah. But- we but Grant, 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 Grant has the advantage. Like he is next to, he is next to the college. So, like, yeah, got too far to go. He, he literally walks downstairs in two minutes, and he's there. Yeah, Not even that across the road. If ever quick. Yeah, yeah no. but um, I think we've been going for like an hour. I think we ran out of topics. So I've got one last game I failed to say um, before uh, we call this episode. <laughs> And it said, when I was talking about driving, it reminded me, my driving in real life is good. My driving in bad in game life, not so good. 
Yeah, does Grant remember never. Friday the Thirteenth? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I can't that f- for that one as well. Oh, that was so funny. That was. David Ledley. What's that? Grant can, yeah, that, that Grant can explain that one. I totally forgot that never, one. Just never let Lee near a car. Yeah. yeah. So we're doing Friday the Thirteenth, and like we're all we're in panic, and 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 we're like trying to get out. I've got like three people in the car and we're about to escape like I think it was d- oh no so one was the killer but we didn't notice until the very end <laughs> are you sure? yeah you were the I, killer I, don't think so. I, I fought the killer for like three times in this one yeah yeah you, you remember? yeah Sam, that's um, quite wrong yeah well yeah one was the killer because he was listening to us oh okay um, and then as I was driving Wong knew exactly where we were going so I was like I can't run this corner now and then you'd, you'd appear there um, <laughs> and trying trying to avoid Wong I tur- I turned Made a sharp turn. I'm like, okay, oh, pick Grant up. Grant's like, I'm running to you. I'm running to you. Wait, wait, wait. And then um, I was looking through the rear mirror and I'm driving forward trying to get away from Long, um, <laughs> who was playing and Jason. And then, um, <laughs> then just smash, uh, full speed straight into Grant. And Grant's like, oh, God, I'm dead. <laughs> it was <laughs> such a shame we were recorded. Well, we were recorded. Well, was it? Uh, it wasn't just Grant. You killed everyone, pretty much. I ran about three people yeah. over. <laughs> so many. Not I just this I... one. There's so many like Tan that you you kill Grant. Oh yeah. Free car. You you kill yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> or like you just left. Or I get stuck left between me. trees and run away because I get. Or you you like <laughs> you say like, sorry, Wong. That's it. <laughs> Hit the I'm, I'm I'm stuck hanging out. I'm like sorry, I've got to leave because Jason's dead. <laughs> I'm saying for myself, <laughs> I'm out of it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think I I think that time you guys could have escaped because I think oh, we would I, well, I I think you would have, but I think I'd make you guys were able to fix everything to her because Wong spotted me first. I think it was, and yeah. then like I was playing around like we were at that bit on you, the, you know the bit where the big table is i think i was running circles with you around that it just <laughs> yeah, got to a right. point where yeah it just got to a point where i was out of stamina and everything like that and then i got killed that's a long table and then like and the next thing you know they were uh, they were about to drive away one goes next to them and lee uh, actually i think it ended up being with one killing like i don't know maybe like like three people and lee killing four people or something like that <laughs> So, so the real right. killer, were, the real killer was actually me, in my yes, <laughs> <laughs> the killer amongst us. Yeah. So, all right, guys. Uh, thanks for joining. Um, I think it's a good place to call the episode. Um, so remember, if you're liking this series, uh, remember to leave a like. Um, subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Um, if you are subscribed, hit the bell to get notified of our upcoming videos, and keep updated on our Facebook and Twitter pages for going on in the gaming world and up. Um, upcoming videos and I'll see you next time on Rambling On and we'll have a surprise topic <laughs>